so good morning to all of you guys because it's still morning it's only 9 41 um but this video is gonna be something a little bit different if you guys know all the fires that be going on in california so you know a lot of people lost their homes a lot of people like don't have like food and you know it's just so much going on so I do live in Fresno and we are going today to go take these people some food you know we got we got a lot of people to give us donations so by the way thank you all of you guys who were able to give us some donations you know I, we really appreciate it and if you guys watch my videos and if you guys donated you guys will see you know us giving other people your guys's stuff that you guys bought for them but yeah but we got a lot of stuff donated we got waters we got um cookies we got um what, what else did we get um canned foods cereals we have um uh top ramen noodles we have all kinds of things going on so what we're gonna do today we're gonna go and we're gonna give these people the food we're gonna divide it um equally between everyone you know and we're gonna pass it out to whoever is in need of food so yeah so that's what's gonna be today it's gonna be our video well my video and you guys will see what what's going on and what is it that we do exactly and yeah so that's gonna be for today so right now i'm gonna drive so safety first i'll catch you guys over there bye two houses and I'm not gonna record the houses and I'm not gonna record people because I don't want to invade no privacy or none of that so yeah so I'm just gonna show you guys like us prepping the bags and us um, taking them and stuff but I won't be recording you know people and their houses so yeah but so far we have taken food to two houses we're up here in Mariposa and they have been so grateful for what they have and what they got and everything and right now we're just gonna stop at this other house right now and deliver more food and some waters
already finished. We took some stuff to some people to their houses, and then we the rest of the stuff we took it to the camping center, I guess you can say, where the firefighters were at and stuff. And we took that over there, and we saw water bottles, but we might take those to the where Red Cross, right? Yeah, Red, we might take them to the Red Cross for the people up north because they said they had enough water there. So. Yeah, and right now we're here at Denny's. We stopped and came to get some breakfast because we have not ate and everybody's in their phones. But hey. <laughs> Look at phone. 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 <laughs> what are you watching? You Sports, you like always. <laughs> What is going to start watching? Becky G. Like always on Instagram. <laughs> what are you watching? Like Instagram too, like always. <laughs> and what are you doing? Let me see. I want to see Fortnite over there. <laughs> So guys, we just got out of Denny's right now, and we are going back to First Snow. Huh, Mia? Mm -hmm. Yes. We're going back to First Snow now. We already ate. We feel good. We feel satisfied, but now I feel sleepy. So, and I have to drive. And Bonnie's just looking at me. Look yeah. at him. And it's in the back. <laughs> He's just looking at me to record, but... Anyways, stop. Something weird. Don't excuse my sister in the background. She's just like, hey, hey, hey. But anyways, so yeah, we're gonna drive back. And like I always say, safety first. So I'm gonna have to let you guys go because I'm driving. Unless you guys want him to take over. What, what are you doing? Princess don't want her car dirty. It's already dirty. I need to go get it cleaned. Right. Do you want to take over or you want to say goodbye? Bye. Hey guys. So the drive back was extremely tiring for me just because I was already tired to begin with and I just had eight. So I got really sleepy and now I'm home laying on my bed. I'm going to take a nap and rest up and when I once I wake up I'll tell you guys why we did why we did what we did and I'm gonna tell you guys what's the reason why we did it and like all that kind of stuff and what was the process and whatnot but right now guys I'm so tired you guys don't even know so I'm gonna take a nap or go to sleep and whenever I wake up either later on tonight or maybe later on in the morning I will explain to you guys like everything and what was the process and all that exciting stuff and you know what was people's reaction I'll let you guys know don't worry but right now I'm gonna rest up I'll see you guys later later on either today or later on either tomorrow <laughs> but anyways I'll see you guys later and thank you bye hey guys okay so I told you guys that whenever I wake up and everything, I would tell you guys more about why we did what we did, okay? So I'm up, I still feel tired, and as you can see, I have really bad eye bags, I don't have full on foundation, no freaking eyeshadow, you know, it's just fast quick thing. You know, going to where I went, it was not like a beauty passion or anything, so yeah. But anyways, so I want to tell you guys um, why we did what we did, okay? Okay, so the reason why we got a lot of people to donate um, supplies, for example, like food, um, waters, and, you know, all that good stuff is because over here in Fresno, California, there's like this um, place called Mariposa. And it's like a little town. It's like going up towards your Yosemite. And there was a really bad fire. There was a really bad fire to where people like, some of them lost their homes. Some of them, you know, like that when the fire happened, they didn't have electricity whatsoever for like a week, I think the lady said. 
and all their food went bad like all their food went bad and then we have firefighters coming from Texas coming from Arizona coming from like different places to like you know put out these fires and you know they don't really have food they have plenty of water which we were told because you know I'll tell you guys in a little bit why but yeah like it's just a lot of things been going on fires here fires there and that was one of our closest destinations so me and some other people which I thank you guys very much for donating what you guys were able to donate for example like the foods the waters the snacks and all that stuff like you know we really appreciate it from the bottom of our hearts and you know and those people appreciate it too you know like this lady got really sad because she said that that you know even though it's been a week already like nobody has done something for them like that she went to this place where they were getting food I guess you can call it a food bank and they told her that she was already too late to get the food so you know that made us feel bad and everything cuz we're like you know like you shouldn't deny stuff like that to someone who's going through stuff you know so what we did we call people we message people we put it in our social medias to donate what they were able to donate and i'm not gonna lie we got pretty pretty like good amount of stuff so once again thank you for all of you guys who watch my videos and you guys donated thank you so much it meant a lot and trust me it meant a lot to those people too like like we went and it was just pretty sad you know to like see them and and for them to like tell us their stories and stuff and yeah oh my god my hair it keeps getting stuck in my forehead sorry guys but anyways so yeah but we went up there we gave them the food and whatnot um and then also whatever was left from what we had we went to um where the firefighters are at and everything you know and and we took them whatever was left and one of the of the officers or I think he was an officer was there and he's like you know like thank you so much like we have plenty of water but we have no goodies like this for example like the cookies the granola and so on you know and um and that's what he said he's like you know like thank you for this you know we really appreciate it and all that stuff and you know and it's crazy because you know people don't really do this it's like really rare you know when people do stuff like this for other people and you know it's just something that you do from your own kindness from your own heart you know and so we did that we gathered stuff we took it up there and everything and the reason why we took it to certain people that you know that we contacted was because I work in a restoration company you know and and one of the clients had called us and she said I'm sorry I couldn't make it to the appointment and so on and she said and she said that it was because she was at the place like I had said trying to get food but they told her it was too late so you know that touched our hearts and we just wanted to do something nice in return for her you know and so we did and we haven't worked at her house yet but yeah like like I said, it's just, you know, something you do, you know. Sometimes when you do things like this for other people, sometimes it comes back to you in a positive way. And it's not only about coming back to, in a positive way or whatever, but, you know, like, if, that w if I was in that position, I would like for somebody to do that for me, like something like that for me, you know. I would really appreciate it and and so we did that we just did that for those people and like i said thank you for everyone being there and for donating and that's why we went out there because we had a customer that was going through this and you know how she was being treated wasn't fairly and that's why we did what we did that's why we went up there and that's why we, that's why we went and helped out in whatever we can help out with you know and hopefully we can do this again and help out more families and more people the only thing is that we don't really know a lot of people out there so it's hard to tell who is the people that actually need it and who is the people that really don't so 
Yeah, but you know, from what I think is that anybody will appreciate that kind of help because I know I would. So like I told you guys, that's why we did what we did. We went out there, we gave them food, water, and we helped out the firefighters as well. You know, like they're out there um, trying to keep these families safe from their house getting, getting ruined and stuff, you know? So that's why we did that. That's why we went out there and it was a really nice experience. Something that I want to do next is for the holidays, I want to set up this thing where we all get together and make some food for the homeless. That's what I want to do. I want to do that because, you know, no matter what these people did, no matter what they've been through, you know, like, they deserve to have a good meal, especially for Thanksgiving. That's my favorite holiday, guys. So, for all of you guys that know me and live close to me, and you know if some of you guys watch my videos which i'm not sure i can't see all of my subscribers but if there's some of you that are not from here you guys can always come for thanksgiving you know like i want to do this thing where we can all get some food and give it out you know just a little something it will brighten up someone's day by just doing that and i know we can do it if we did this for these people, I'm pretty sure we can do this for the homeless. So, if you guys are interested, if you guys want to help out or something, let me know. And that's something I want to do. Um, if you guys really want to do it, like I said, let me know down in the comments. Send me a text. Call me. Send me a mes message through my social media. Don't matter. Let me know because that's something I want to do. If you're interested, let's do it. I mean we have a long time to prep if we can get so much now for example if we were if you know what how about whichever whoever wants to help me out hit me up send me a message comment whatever and we can figure something out we can either buy something for these people for thanksgiving or we can make something so yeah but that's why we did what we did and like I said, you want to help out? Let me know. But yeah, but like always like, share, and subscribe. And turn on the bell of the notifications. If you don't turn that on, you're not going to get advice when I upload a video. So yeah. And if you're watching this video and if you're not yet subscribed, subscribe. Subscribe. Hit that subscribe button now. But anyways, I will see you guys in my next video. Hopefully, you know, you guys were able to see some of the stuff I like I told you guys earlier like I didn't want to like record nobody's face nobody's house because that's invasion of pro uh, privacy so I didn't want to do that so yeah but I got what I could and hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and you guys were able to see our experience that we had so yeah I'll see you guys in my next video peace